hey guys welcome back hope you are doing well in this video i'm going to discuss a very basic but an important question and that is what is the difference between unique and distinct method in rails so both are methods in rails and that can be used to get unique active record objects from database but there are a few differences in both unique and distinct that unique is a ruby method for array and distinct is an sql query method okay let's try to understand this by an example i have a book model in my application so let me fetch all the books book dot all dot unique it will return me all the book which are unique and i can perform this one as well books equal to book dot all dot distinct okay it will run the same query and re return with the same result but there is one difference in both methods that unique is a method for ruby array so if you check the type of this books collection books dot class then you will see that this is an instance of array class okay and if you execute it like uh, book dot all dot distinct and if you ex execute books dot class then you will see that now it is the instance of active record relation so when you use uh, sorry when the, your returning collection is of array class then you can only apply array methods uh, or you can only chain array method further to that collection but if it is your active record relation instance then you can further apply uh, the sql query methods too for example now if you do this like let's say book dot all dot unique then you cannot apply order query on this collection order id okay so now you can check undefined method for order and on this array why because order is an sql query okay not an array method but if you do the same with book dot all dot distinct now you can see that uh, it has executed the order query on it similarly uh, you can think of uh, other uh, sql methods like limit so you cannot apply limit to this method as well let's say limit 5 then you will again see the error undefined method limit for the array why because limit is an sql method but if you do it like limit 5 then you will get the first five books from the collection okay so this is the main difference between unique and distinct and also that also unique is uh, less powerful than distinct because when your database is very large and you want to perform uh, other query as chain on the return collection then you must use distinct rather than unique method okay but unique is uh, beneficial in one case only when you don't want to execute one extra query on the collection okay for example if you execute it like book equal to book dot all okay now if you execute books dot unique then you will see that uh, no extra query will be performed here okay only you have to perform one query query at one time that is books equal to book dot all and you don't have to perform any extra query to get all the unique books but if you do it like books equal to book dot all and now if you perform books dot distinct now you will see 
that this distinct has required one query to execute okay so this is also difference that uh, for example you have a collection already uh, faced from some query and if you apply unique method on that collection then you do not need to run uh, or no extra sql queries running in the background but if you invoke distinct method on that collection then it requires an extra sql query to be performed okay so this is the difference between unique and uh, distinct method okay and one more thing that you need to remember that unique is deprecated in rails 5 and you should use distinct instead okay so that's it i hope you liked it and learned the difference between unique and distinct thanks for watching the video let's meet into the next video with another good question till then tata goodbye take care and stay safe